You can find a link for Final Sight under Staff, BISD Teacher Links, and Final Sight. Once you're logged into Final Sight, this is your dashboard. You change your password here if you would like to change it from the default. You can even uncheck this box so that this dashboard does not appear every time that you log in. It is nice though because it does have a shortcut to your most recent activity which is generally just your home page or the other pages that you own that you've been working on. You can also get to editing your pages on the unpublished tab. If you check the published tab, since this is the first time that this account has been logged into, there's nothing published and we can't do any editing here. You must go to the unpublished tab always to do all of your editing. If you don't get finished editing in the unpublished tab, you can always hit save and it will be there for you to come back to later on before you publish it. Once in the unpublished tab, you'll see that you have a home page and a My Classroom page. These are just the two default options for all teachers. You can add more pages or delete these pages if you would like. In the unpublished tab, you will see little yellow E's next to the boxes that you can edit. The E stands for edit. So here if I select this E, I have a word processing window that pops up. Here's where I can type my information. So you would want to type the basics, your contact information, maybe your conference time, maybe your daily schedule, and you can edit this just as you would on any other word processor. Once you have typed in the editing window and you're ready to save that, you must hit save here in the editing window, then you must hit save again here in the top left hand corner of the page. This is always the case, you have to save twice. Now this will always be saved in my unpublished tab if I navigate back there. It is still not in my published tab because I still have not hit published. When you're ready for these changes to go live on the internet, after you've saved it in the unpublished tab, you hit the yellow P for publish. When you hit publish, select the pages that you want to publish. I've only made changes to my home page, so I select that. Now these changes are live on the internet, and you know that by going to the Publish tab to see what everyone else sees.